Okay, this is just for LBJ on Blender Artists who was asking how to use symmetry following on from setting up panel tests. So I'm just going to take this base object, which as you can see is really simple. I'm just going to copy that, stick it into a new layer, go into edit mode. So say we were going to add some things into this, so we just K okay, cut something out here. Basic cuts. And uh, we'll do something on the front as well. sure you select everything because if you don't symmetrize doesn't work go to mesh symmetrize and you can see you've got your options here and at the moment it's selecting left to right on that so if I pull up the options with the F6 you can play around with them until you get the angle, the axis you want which is basically determined by that so that's negative y to positive y and if we accept that then you can select everything and then if I symmetrize again what I can do this time is do negative x to positive x or positive x to negative x. So now I've got a complete copy of the whole thing. And then if you make a change select everything. You can use symmetrize. I've got it assigned to a hotkey so I'll use that in future. And then do it again. Select everything. F6. And there's your object. So if we take these we extrude them out a tad. Take those. We extrude them in. Select everything. Symmetrize. You can see that that's copied it that way. some funny shading because of the various angles. So I'll just boundary loop, make that sharp. And 
I'm still not doing it. Oh, I've not put smooth on, that's why. It does help if I click smooth. That's a bit better. Take that. And we can... make that sharp as well. So that's it, that's basically all symmetry does.